Uh, I started making soap because when I was a little kid, my grandmother made it. Um, and so I could watch her as long as I didn't talk. <laughs> so I would sit behind her and watch her. And when I got older, uh, I graduated college and so I was broke. And so I made soap for everybody for Christmas one year. And a couple of months later, people started calling back saying, hey, can you make me some more of that? I'm Sophie Jones and I run Left Hand Soap Company in Tuscaloosa. So it was a nickname that my husband Eric gave me when I was, or when he came in about 12 years ago. And I liked it and it stuck. And so about, I don't know, six years ago maybe, I legally changed it. And, and I think I legally changed it because people kept asking, oh, but yeah, but what's your real name? Today we are making our Rosemary Detox. And that is our standard olive oil and coconut and castor base with activated charcoal, bentonite clay, and rosemary essential oil. It's really good for oily skin. It's one of my favorites. And um, it's really pretty. We started in 1999, so we've been doing it for 17 years. It'll be 18 years this year. We make 35 different kinds of solid soap, six ongoing kinds of liquid soap, and then we have two special editions. The only reason why we opened the storefront was because people started knocking on the door. Um, we, we opened this space as a workshop. We didn't even put a sign up, and people started knocking on the door going, hey, I saw your car, Is it, can we come in? It was overwhelming. We didn't expect it. The communities, Southern Makers, the, all of the festivals that have opened up, all of the, the farmers markets that have opened up over the last um, 10 years, 15 years, have made a huge difference. And it's sometimes hard for me to explain the difference between owning a small business 17 years ago and owning a small business now, just in terms of access to support. There's no way for me to quantify it.